Hi everybody, I'm Victoria Aveyard. I am the author of the Red Queen series. I am also the author of the brand new series, Realm Breaker. The first book comes out May 4th. Very excited. Realm Breaker is a fantasy adventure that asks the question, what do we do when the heroes fail? Who do we turn to? And in this case, it is a team of enemies and misfits thrown together and kind of forced to save themselves and maybe the world in the process. As some of you guys might know, I live for twists. I live for secrets. I love a betrayal. I love surprising my audience. I can't tell you too much. I love tricking you guys. So I wanted to give you a little, some tips and juicy secrets about Realm Breaker, if that's okay. Secret number one, Realm Breaker includes a relationship dynamic that I have been wanting to write since the beginning of Red Queen. And I couldn't do it in Red Queen because it didn't make sense for the characters and who they were. But I finally get to do it here. Don't know if I can tell you what it is. Oh, who cares? No one's gonna stop me. It is a villain romance. It is two villains who like each other. Secret number two. There were a lot of superpowers in Red Queen. There are no superpowers in Realm Breaker. There are characters who are immortal and they have enhanced abilities. There are characters who have magic. If I did have to say someone had a superpower, I would say the main character, Corrine. She is a teenager, a pirate's daughter, who all she wants to do is see the world, and her mom, the pirate, won't let her. How hypocritical. I would say that Corrine's superpower is her mind. She's incredibly smart. She's very gifted with languages. She's good at maps, my favorite thing, and she is incredibly logical. So she is able to use that to her great advantage throughout the book. Secret number three, Realm Breaker revolves around the concept of spindles, which are essentially portals to other worlds. Um, at the beginning of Realm Breaker, all of the spindles have disappeared. All the portals are closed until somebody decides they're going to tear them open. And that's where we find ourselves. I had a really good time figuring out creatures and monsters and overlaps of different worlds and getting to play with things I've never gotten to play with before. Realm Breaker definitely feels like a toy box where I got to pull out everything I wanted and figure out a way to play with them all together. And that's all I can say for now. May 4th. See you there. Be ready. Hi, I'm Victoria Aveyard. Thank you for watching. To watch more videos from Epic Reads, click here or subscribe here.